Welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your monthly general love message for July 2020. Okay, Libra, let's get right into the love energy around you for the month of July. All right, let's go. Libra, what are the love energies, angels? We're checking in with Libra. Four. And remember, these are always right side up because we're getting all the love energy out of it that we can. Angels and guides, positive energy for Libra. What is the love around Libra? Yes, yes, yes. Love around Libra for the month of July. Come on, angels. What's going on? What is going on? Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy for the love energy around Libra. Libra for the seventh month of 2020. Oh, wh where did that? Where did that go? Angels and guides, pause. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Positive energy for the love energy around Libra. Yes, yes, yes. For July. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Positive energy, please. Positive energy for beautiful, beautiful Libra and handsome <laughs> beautiful beautiful libra positive energy with yes 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 positive energy with libra <laughs> libra seven the seventh month yes the seventh month of 20 thank you thank you thank you angels moving on to the angels deck angels positive energy the love 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 romantic love I'm, yes, 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 romantic love for Libra. Now, of course, we always top it off with, yes, 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 the hummingbird deck, angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy, please, positive energy for, yes, Libra, positive energy for Libra, and I feel that goes there, positive energy, blowing some love <laughs> for the love reading angels and guys positive energy for libra for seven the seventh month yes 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 for the seventh month i feel like that goes right there now let's get into the love energy libra bum, 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 bum. all right so major theme for your love romantic love yes 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 you have inner peace how about that? Major influence of your relationship is inner peace. The angel of beauty. Yes, yes. Foundation and achievements. How beautiful is that? Life review with the two of diamonds and the nine of clubs. So I definitely feel when it comes to love this month, what you are desiring, whether you are in a relationship or not, right? Doesn't matter. Okay, this is all about the love energy. You are desiring in your romantic love, you are desiring inner peace. This is what you are shooting for this month with the angel of beauty. That is the beauty of love, the peace, the joy, foundation and achievement. I feel that is what you are going after with the life review. I definitely see you taking stock. Do I have joy? Do I have peace? Do I have inner peace about my love, love that is here or love that may come down the road. That is what I'm looking for. With the two of diamonds, I feel like there are certain things about relationships, about love, yes, that you are willing to let go of for inner peace. So if that inner peace means I need to stay by myself for a little bit until I get that inner peace, or I am in a relationship and I am desiring inner peace peace. Yes, yes, yes. Now, when we look at the recent past when it came to your love, you had manifestation Libra with angel of sweet delight, mental conflict, creative writing, three of hearts, and the seven of spades. So in the recent past, when it came to your love, I feel like you had been working on manifestation. 
manifesting your love, your romantic love that you wanted in your life. I feel like you did that not in an aggressive way, but in a very sweet, maybe little bit of manipulative way, but not so aggressive, right? With the mental conflict, I definitely feel like you, um, you created some worry around you a little bit when it came to love. I see you doing a little bit of creative writing, maybe texting, if you will. With the three of hearts, you were still uncertain, a lot of uncertainty in the past. Maybe you were uncertain about a third party situation. Not very happy about it either. Okay, now, and if it was not a third party situation with this three of hearts, you were just worried in general. You were just worried in general. With the seven of spades, it may have caused some, um, I feel like it may have caused some, uh, a ruckus in your love life with that worry. Now, Yes, yes, you know that you know that, that old saying, Libra, be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. Okay, so that is in the recent past. Now, when we look in the middle of the month, we have compatibility in your romantic love sector with a spiritual tempest and stand your ground. Gifts from God, four of spades, nine of hearts. So I definitely feel like in, in the middle of the month, yes. There is compatibility in your romantic love life with the um. I feel like, I feel like with the sweet tempest. I feel like there is a temptation to. It's almost like the opposite of compatibility. It's almost like okay. I'm I'm thinking maybe maybe I I I'm causing some ruckus if that makes sense. But. It is necessary. Stand your ground. Definitely stand your ground in your love life. Gifts from God. There's definitely, um, your angels are around you when this, um, I, I feel like your angels are supporting this. Your angels are supporting this. With the four of spades, I see a definite security. It's like you want what you want. You want what you want. And with the nine of hearts, it's almost like, look, this might cause a little ruffle of the feather, but this is what I need. I need stability. I need, um, I need peace. I need inner peace. And if the person that you are with is not supplying that, yes, with the nine of hearts, I feel that you may decide to let them go now or or they just step up and give you the inner peace that you are looking for. Because in the past, it looks like you didn't have emotional peace when it came to your love life. Now, when we look, that's with or without a relationship. Now, in, by the end of the month, um, Libra, you have distorted female with the feminine energy, with the... Um, 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 it's like angel of fidelity, conflict, defeat, passion, eight of spades, jack of diamonds. So I feel like by the end of the month with a distorted female, this could be male or uh, this could be male or female. I definitely am picking up an energy of maybe someone is not everything that you wanted them to be. Maybe they're, um, and I feel like, I feel like I, I pick up the angel of fidelity. I feel like they are committed to who they are right where they are like, like um they're not gonna change they're committed to that right with it and you feel like you know i'm just i feel like with the committed conflict and defeat whoever this is in your world whether relationship or not you're thinking you know i can't change this person and then why would you want to anyway right because then because that's not the person you fell in love with or that's not the person you would fall in love with. You fell in love with them just this way. You know, a lot of people fall in love with people and then, then say, you know, I could change that about them. But that's not who you fell in love with. So if you fell in love with somebody that was maybe messy, right, messy, guess what? They're messy. You fell in love with them while they were messy. You can't change them. No, you can't. Okay, so with the eight of spades, I definitely feel like there is an element that you are just like... Okay. All right. And there's power in that. There's power in realizing that you cannot change a person. I feel you are definitely passionate about um, um, creative energy. I feel you're passionate about, I feel there's still a little bit of, um, maybe I can try, maybe I can, maybe there's a little bit I can change. Maybe I can't change the big package, but maybe there's a little bit, right? Now, when we look at, I'm just going to leave that alone. Okay, Libra. All right. So when we look at the 
bonus. You have emotional freedom with angel of diversity and the universe with the outdoors, the two of spades, the four of clubs and the seven of clubs. So when it comes to romance, it feels like emotional freedom. I feel like you are a bit detached. I feel like you are more so in your own feelings, um, into your own peace, your own joy, things of that nature. You're starting to look into what you love about love, not necessarily what they love or their desires or things of that nature. Um, it's about you and, and what, what serves your, your love energy, if you will. With the angel of diversity, I feel you trying on different, um, experiences. I feel like you're, you're, you're feeling like, um, you want to know what is it that truly fulfills me what truly fulfills me with the universe it's like you're tapping into your higher self you i feel like with the outdoors you're a bit detached with your partnerships this month this this month your bonus but with the four clubs i don't necessarily see you going anywhere um i don't see you going anywhere unless the seven of clubs turns a little bit negative now you can be in a relationship and kind of just you know i'm just gonna kind of go do my own thing for a little bit with the seven of clubs and i'm just gonna kind of let it be what it will be right yeah you like, eh, I have to, I feel like it's a matter of, I have to find out what my love language is. You know, a lot of times we, we put more emphasis on someone else's love languages and we, we give so much to the other person, whomever, whether you're in a relationship or, or potential, whoever, we, we, we want to love them more. We want to love them more than we love ourselves, right? But this month, it's time to step back find your inner peace it's 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 almost like you know if you're gonna bring me peace i'm gonna accept your peace if you're not gonna bring me peace you know <laughs> let's take a little breather if you know what i mean so i send you joy namaste and much much love sent your way